So let's take a look at HeyGen. We're going to click into login, and that's going to put us into the HeyGen screen. Then we're going to click on create an avatar. Then it's going to take us to Josh, the founder. We're just going to blow through Josh. Sorry about that. And we're going I'm to so excited. Motion. Motion's going to help us. Even though I'm sitting still, I like to use my hands. Here are the rules and regulations that you should use, or guidelines, really, for creating your video. I don't follow them, and you'll see the consequences. Okay, so let's get a file. Let's load something up. This is an old video that I did before in my own basement, so I didn't really worry about if it really conformed to everything that was asked. And you'll see, again, those consequences. And I don't think I want the background noises, so I'm going to get rid of that. Okay, and let's click here and continue. So now I have to give permission of what I'm doing. So I go ahead and I give them my video and audio and then I go ahead and record my permission statement so you can see that I, I want to make sure I get the right camera and then this is a statement I'm not going to read it to you because you know um, you can read it yourself and you don't want to sit here and listen to me reading it but basically it counts down it shows you you read it you're done you upload it as I'm doing here and then it takes a while to upload so it's uploads and then maybe you want to have a little bit of coffee and then maybe you want to have a little bit more coffee and then maybe even maybe a little bit more coffee and then finally you're going to get to the place where it's almost there it's almost there ah there we are now it uploads again and you might want to have a little bit more coffee as that uploads and it still chugs along but it's doing a lot of processing so it chugs for a while and then oh we're done. Okay, so now let's take a look at this video. I think it'll be pretty interesting uh, as, as soon as it gets done. But then once it's done, here we are. We're inside the editing of HeyGen. We can add the script. We can even add some other elements to our items. It uses a timeline kind of thought. Let's listen. Hello, I am excited and thrilled that you could join me. Hi, I'm AI Dr. Carl Kopp. Glad you could stop by and take a look at this AI video. As an AI version of Dr. Cop, I can speak to you as if I was an actual person, but I am AI generated from a video. What do you think? Do you like this AI avatar? Does it look like Dr. Cop? We, AI avatars, can now be embedded into training courses, marketing videos, or even weekly messages that you'd like to send to folks within your organization. This was made with a simple upload of a video that I created in my basement studio. Links to the items in the studio are in the description. As you can see, that's not a bad video. Now, the source video had a couple problems, like I didn't follow all the directions, my hands were in front of my face, so that's a problem, um, and I had some glitches there. But if you overlook those couple of glitches, you can see that that's a pretty good AI version of Dr. Cop. Hello, it's Dr. Carl Kopp. Well, actually, it's Dr. Kopp HeyGen Digital Avatar. This avatar was recorded according to the guidelines from HeyGen. Glad you could stop by and take a look at this AI video. We, AI avatars, can now be embedded into training courses, marketing videos, or even weekly messages that you'd like to send to folks within your organization. This was made with a simple upload of a video that I created in my basement studio. Links to the items in the studio are in the description of this video. There you have it, two AI avatars created by HeyGen. What do you think? Leave your thoughts in the comments below. There you have it, two AI avatars of Dr. Cop created by HeyGen. What do you think? Leave your thoughts in the comments below.